I'm hooking up a cadet baseboard electric heater. These are the two things you're going to need. You're going to have to have some way to use a thermostat. I think the instructions are actually pretty fairly easy to read and understand. Today we're going to be hooking it up this way. I'm doing the 240 volts. First thing you're going to need to do is mount that, that up to the wall and put the wires through. Take one side off, whatever side you're doing it. Got that tight. We're gonna go ahead and mount it to the wall. There's little spots on here that makes the screw go in fairly easy. So we have to find some studs. Great. For the wiring, this, this one that has it going to the top is the one you want to cut. And that's the only one that you need to cut. The other one you don't need to cut. And then to the, the two blacks, go to the two black wires.
then the two red go to the two red uh, hot wires. And it doesn't matter which one because they're both wires are hot. If you're not using three wires, you're going to be using the white as a hot since I'm doing 240. And since I'm not using the neutral wire, I'm just going to put a cap on it and shove it in there too. The reason why I still put a cap on it is because you never know when people are messing in the box, they might take it out and while they're playing around it might hit a hot. You don't want it to be hot coming into the box. this helps if you're trying to hook up one of these cadet baseboard heaters and need a little help on the wiring. See you guys later. If you're hooking it up on the other side there's just one that you need to cut so you can't get confused on this one so you just cut this one and then these blacks hook up to the two blacks and then these two hots go to the two hots. All right.